In this video, we're going to be talking about Pinterest's new feature called Place Pins. Place Pins basically give you the ability to create a map for your curated board uh, that you own. So in the case we're looking here is we're looking at the best burgers and brew in the Big Apple, and this is curated by Thrillist. So if you scroll down the left-hand side here, um, we'll, you'll see the uh, different um, restaurants that they've curated. And you'll notice that there's a number next to each of these uh, locations. That's when they just added them. So um, it just maps it to the map. And if I click on that number there, you'll get a uh, pop-up box. Uh, you'll get the business name up here. Uh, this will be the category assigned through Foursquare, because Foursquare is driving this data for Pinterest. The address information, the phone number, and then the Learn More button, which basically will take you to the website. So for a small business that has a single location or multi-location, what I would suggest is to create a, a new board uh, for your location or locations. I would name your board um, the name of your business and then pr provide a nice description here, which has a max of 500 characters. Once you do that, I would go back to your site and start pinning. So let's move over here. I'm going to quickly create um, a board. Some great description about my business. Choose the category that's most appropriate for it. So let's just do technology at this point and you want to add a map to it, just select that as yes. Um, if you want to make it a secret, basically that just hides it from the search engines and hides it from the public view. Otherwise it's by, uh, public by default. Just click on the create board. And now I have um, my new board here. So what happens now is now we have this add place button. So I can click that. It, what I'll have to do is search for my business name. And so when I search for my business, it's going to look for um, all the businesses that match through four squares. So there's another Thrive Internet Marketing. So this is the location that we have in Arlington. So I'm going to map that. And so what you can do is once you have that mapped here, you can write a short description. So I basically want to put the uh, business information in here. So what I'm going to do is just grab the business address, put that in there, and then say some great stuff about it. Great WordPress development company, Arlington, Texas. Okay, so I just filled out a short description here. And then it lets you either choose a, um, some images. You could upload your image if you want to. I'll just pin our boss's face here. So now we have this mapped to our location with some content information. And then if I click on the, the location listing, now it pops up from our four squares profile. So you could have multiple locations and map this. What I've seen is, is that it, these, these individual boards are ranking and they are a good way to create business, local business citations. And local business citations are just one factor that goes into helping you rank in the local search results on Google. Um, and so it's just a great way to, to have that and you have all your location information there. Um, and if you needed to, you could always share that. But, uh, but I think the biggest thing is the local search, uh, building the citation for that. So there you go. That's the new feature for Pinterest boards. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Thanks.